Hello everyone. Welcome back to Rosie Maths class. Today we shall discuss question number 4 of exercise 2.3 chapter 2 polynomials. Factorize. Factorize means to find out the factors. First one 12x squared minus 7x plus 1. We are going to use the method of splitting the middle term. We are going to split this middle term and find out the factors. So first write this term as it is 12x squared and the last term also remains as it is. Multiply 12 and 1. So 12 into 1 is equal to 12. Find out the factors of 12. 1 into 12 is 12. 2 into 6 is 12. 3 into 4 is 12. So we need two numbers whose product is 12 and whose sum is minus 7. Because there is a minus sign here, we will take minus 4 plus minus 3. This pair, 3 and 4. You can take minus 3 plus minus 4 or minus 4 plus minus 3. It's the same thing. And here also, minus 4 into minus 3 is 12. So, minus 4x minus 3x. Now, we got 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 terms. We will find the common factors of first 2 terms. So, 12 and 4. 4 is common. And here 2x and here 1x. So, 4x. 4 into 3 is 12. So, 3x. 4x minus 1. See, 4 into 3, 12. 12x squared. 4x and minus 1 is minus 4x. Minus 3x plus 1. The only common factor is 1. So, 1 and then 3x. Now, this plus sign will change into minus sign. Minus 1. Because see, when we take minus as a common factor, minus 1 into 3x is minus 3x. And this plus is minus into minus. Minus minus becomes plus. So, that's minus 1. Remember, whenever you have a minus sign outside, if you got a plus sign inside, make it a minus sign. Now, we have two terms, this one and this one. So, the common factor that we have is 3x minus 1 here and 3x minus 1. So, 3x minus 1 and what is left? 4x minus 1. So, these are the factors of 12x squared minus 7x plus 1. Second one. 2x squared plus 7x plus 3. First term remains as it is 2x squared. Last term also remains as it is plus 3. We need to split the middle term 7. So first we will multiply 2 into 3. 2 into 3 is 6. Find out the factors of 6. 1 into 6 is 6. 2 into 3 is 6. Find two numbers whose sum is the middle term which is the coefficient of the middle term which is 7 and find two numbers whose product is 6. So we can take 1 and 6. 1 plus 6 and 1 into 6. You can write this as plus x plus 6x plus 3 equals to first two terms. Take out the common factor. The only common factor is x. So x, 2x plus 1 plus 6x six, six and 3. The only common factor is 3. So 3, 3 into 2, 6, 2x plus 1. Now see, two terms only, this one and this one. The common factor we have is 2x plus 1. So 2x plus 1 and then x plus 3. It doesn't matter whether you write 6x first or x first. The final answer would be same. 2x plus 1 into x plus 3 or x plus 3 into 2x plus 1. And both are correct because both are same. Third one. 6x squared plus 5x minus 6. 6x squared remains as it is, minus 6 remains as it is, we need to split 5x. So, for that multiply 6 and minus 6. 
six into minus six is minus thirty six. Find out the factors of thirty six. One into thirty six, two into eighteen, three into twelve, four into nine, and six into six. So these are the factors of thirty six. We need two numbers that add up to five. So that will give us five. And two numbers whose product is minus thirty six. We can take this pair nine x plus minus four x or sorry nine plus minus four nine plus minus four would give you five, and nine into minus four will give you minus thirty six. So we can take these two numbers. Write five x as plus nine x minus four x. Nine x minus four x is five x. First two terms find out the common factors. Six nine. So we got three and x three x x two x three into two is six six x squared plus three. See three two is a six x into x x squared. Three three is a nine x minus four x and minus six. The common factor is two, so we are left with two x. And here there is a minus sign, so we will change it to plus three. So whenever we have a minus sign, the inside sign would change. If that's a minus, it will become plus. If it's a plus, it will become minus. Remember that. And these two expressions must always be the same, like two x plus three, two x plus three. So now, what do we have common? Two x plus three is common in both these terms. Two x plus three, and then three x minus two. Three x minus two. So these are the factors of six x squared plus five x minus six. And the last one, three x squared. Minus x minus four. First term remains as it is. Last term remains as it is. We need to split the middle term. So three into minus four is equal to minus twelve. Factors of twelve. Find out the factors of twelve. One into twelve. Two into six. Three into four. Now two terms that add up to the middle term, which is Minus one with x we don't have any number so that's minus one and two terms whose product is minus twelve. We can take this pair minus four plus three. Now see minus four plus three is minus one and minus four into three is minus twelve. So we are going to take these two numbers minus four x. Plus three x. See what is common in the first two terms. We just have x. Only x is common. So x we take out. We are left with three x minus four. You can check. X into three x. Three x squared. X into four. Four x. Plus. Here it is plus. So we don't need to change any sign inside. And the only common factor is one. So one. 3x minus 4. Both these expressions must be same. 3x minus 4, 3x minus 4. So now we just have two terms. Take the common factor, which is 3x minus 4, and then x plus 1 multiplied by x plus 1. So this is the factor of 3x squared minus x minus 4. Well, that's all for today. See you in the next video.